lastly, let us discuss this pancreatic uh, adeno, this uh, carcinoma. This carcinoma is usually 90 if not more percent in the head of the pancreas. This pancreas will have a patch, try to understand, it will have a patch in the head area. That patch will be ill-defined and what will be the ecogenicity? Why? Now, if it is not hyper, if it is not, then it has to be hypo. <laughs> Why hypo? Anywhere, CA anywhere in body, CA anywhere in body will be hypo, not hyper. Question, why a carcinoma is hypo? If it is a dead tissue, then this is not carcinoma. No, you are hitting, hit and trialing. Don't give me the answer by hit and trial only. What a carcinoma is? No, no, no. What a carcinoma is? Carcinoma is an area where I am having a, a rapid multiplication of the cells. In cells, I am having 60 to 70 percent cytoplasm and I am having more than half of water, I mean the fluid, right? Now, if I am having more cells, try to understand, if I am having more cells in an area, now this area was having previously 100 cells, normal. Now this area is the C area. Now this will not have 100, but 1000, if not 10,000. What will happen to the fluid ratio in that area? Will that increase or decrease? And if fluid is increasing in an early area, what will be the net, net ecogenicity of that area? So whenever you are seeing a hypoechoic area that is more worrisome than a hyperechoic area, anywhere in body. And if there is a dead cell, dead tissue, that is calcification, right? So calcification is going against malignancy. If you see a calcified foci, a bund, dead tissue over there, that is going against malignancy. What a malignancy is? Rapidly growing, multiplying cells. And what a calcification is? A bundle, a bunch of a dead cell. Are they not contradicting? They are. That is why if I see a calcified foci, I will say, Thank God. Why? Because this is going in favor of benign, not malignant. So this is the golden rule for malignancy and the uh, benign uh, to rule out this or that for anywhere in body. So here I will be having a hypoechoic patch and that hypoechoic patch will be irregular. Will be irregular. And on putting a color, it will show me color. So if you see a pancreatic, you know, uh, if there is an area which is focally speared in lipomatous uh, pancreas, that will not show me, first of all, that will not show me high vasculature, number one. Number two, this is more to understand, less to show. Number two. Will there be any mass effect in case of uh, the, uh, if it is an area which is speared? No, it will not be. But if it is CA, and where that CA is usually in the neck of the, uh, in the head of the uh, pancreas. And if it is in the head of the pancreas, it will compress onto the biliary tract. It is more to understand. Then if it is compressing and if it is a true uh, CA patch over there, then I will be having dilatation above, dilatation above in one line, dilatation above. So if you are about to label this patch as a uh, patch for a focal sparing, ask your gallbladder, how are you? He will tell you, I am distended. <gasps> it can be a malignant case. 
and if you are about to label a, a carcinoma and your gallbladder is telling me, doctor, I am okay, then you have to put questions to yourself, why gallbladder you are okay then? Maybe I am not dealing with malignant case. This is the reason why most of the, most of the repeating, most of the, uh, the CAs are missed. And the gallbladder CAs are also missed. And when diagnosed, they are already crossed all limits. So now think what wire will be. Now I don't need to show you any picture. You have to think from here and don't copy paste these uh, pictures. Of course, we will show you pictures, but the point here is that please don't copy paste these pictures. Now over here, I told you 70, 80, sometimes some literature is telling us 90% are in the head of the pancreas. The basic important point is what will happen to the uh, pancreatic duct? It will dilate it. What will above structures look like? Abnormal. And if I take an uh, IVC in length, inferior vena cava in length, I will see that mass sitting on the top of the inferior vena cava because I know my anatomy in long tunnel section. So this will be the picture like. Now a patch over here. We try to understand hypoechoic patch. Hypoechoic patch is a carcinoma, but not all. <coughs> but not all. Because sometimes I can have a focal sparing. How to differentiate that is already discussed. Okay, so see this hypoechoic mass. This is the mass over here. And this is the pancreatic duct, which is dilated over here. Again, see, not a big, but a small patch, hypoechoic patch over here. But this small patch, even if near to the uh, biliary tract duct, can uh, give me the obstruction high above. So if you are having obstructive signs, then this small has to be fined. You have to find it. If there is no stone, try to understand. If there is no stone, and if you got a stone, then you don't need to search for this much. But if there is no stone, then you have to give 15 more minutes for this fetal, uh, for this uh, head, pancreatic head to get scanned and exclude this CA from the pancreas. Okay. So, if you have any question, okay.